and today the topic of discussion is merge short program in C. So I request you if you are directly coming to this video, kindly watch the video number one that is of algorithm of merge short because there I have explained you each and everything very very clearly. In this video, I'll just show you the syntax of a program because I've already explained you the logic. So if you are, if you don't want to waste your time, if you want to understand this video very easily, I, I promise you, if you see that video, this programming will become a, just a topic of five minutes just only a topic of five minutes everything I've explained you in the previous video so kindly watch the video and then come to this video so let's start with the program so what what uh, is uh, the program all about that is uh, now what I'm doing is that I have created a macro of uh, si size 8 then I've created the array of same macro size that is of 8 size that I've created an array of size 8 that is from 0 1 2 3 let me make every 0 1 2 3 4 5 then 6 and 7 of size 8 fine what I did then I asked uh, I've created two variable i and j then enter and print the unsorted element uh, that is the screen will uh, have such uh, printing line so I, I have asked user to start from 0 till 7 element enter those element and while entering I'm printing those elements suppose user has entered what 9 3 2 1 5 uh, uh, 6 uh, then 10 and then suppose 12 so what will happen the moment he is uh, uh, entering the values I I'm also printing those values fine so it, it will seem it will show something like this now what I have to do is start I have to sort this so what I will do I'll simply call merge short so I, I'm calling merge short I'm calling merge short with value 0 and 7 fine so what will happen it will automatically jump it will not move inside it will automatically jump where uh, to the definition of merge short so see this definition of merge short I'll part this value uh, 0 and the 7 value high over here. Now what will happen? I'll check is no not equal to high. There I was checking what start and end. In algorithm I was checking start is not is less than end. Again I'm doing the same thing. Is low not equal to high? Either you can put not less than. You can put anything. No. Is not equal to high? Yes it's not equal to high. Because low is 0, 7. So condition is true. What I'll do? I'll, I'll calculate mid. So that is what is mid? 0 plus 7 by 2. What is 0? 0 is 0. Uh, 7 is 7. 7. 0 plus 7 is 7. 7 by 2 is what? 3.5 is what? 3. So what will be the value of mid? 3. So what I'll do? I'll call merge short. There I was calling merge short with one more argument which was array. Since here we have created an array globally. So I'll simply pass the argument with uh, you know, starting and ending value. So I'm ca calling merge short. What am I doing is I'm calling merge short with value 0, 3. And then again I'm calling with merge short mid plus 1 that is 4 to uh, 7. And then I'm calling what merge from where that is from start to mid till end. And you have seen this. Up, what is missing in this part is that I'm not using array otherwise everything is same so what will happen again what will happen so when I have passed these three value array is broken into three part that is merge short merge short and merge finally this function will be called again the value will become what zero and three so I've explained you everything I've explained you everything so what will happen it will uh, so let me uh, 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 no, show you this so is zero not equal to three yes zero is not equal to three condition is true I'll calculate the mid zero plus three by two is 1.5 is one so I'll call merge short from zero to one I'll call merge short this function will break into through broken into three parts zero uh, mid plus one to end and uh, if I'm not wrong zero plus uh, what zero this is what 0 plus 3 is 1.5 uh, 1 okay fine so 0 1 and then uh, then mid plus 1 that is mid plus 1 2 to 3 and then merge then merge start mid and end finally what will happen I'll call this function uh, when I'll call this function what will happen uh, so let me write over here uh, when I'm calling this function let me call let me write over here so what it will again pass this value 0 and 1 over here is low not equal to high zero yes condition is true I'll again calculate mid 0 plus 1 by 2 is what 0 0.5 is 0 so I'll call merge short from what start to mid I'll call merge short from where from mid plus 1 1 to end then merge from start mid end so what will happen I'll again call this value I'll again call this function and I'll, when I will put value 0 0 what will happen when I'll put value 0 0 is 0 not equal to 0 condition will become false and I'll not do anything when I'll put 1 1 again the condition will become false and finally I'll call what I'll call 
uh, merge 0 0 1 that is the first element and the second element to need to be merged and in merge what am I passing is 0 0 and 1 so hope you understood understand that in previous video I've created a temporary array I have created a temporary array of same size of array I've initialized I with low that is there I was initializing I with start K with low K with start and J with mid plus 1 and again the same loop uh, while i is less than equal to mid and j is less than equal to high the same same now if you see the same this part this part is exactly same as of algorithm so i'll not explain you anything i just request you to kindly watch the video, uh, video number one of Marshot so that this will become very easy for you to understand and finally i i, I did everything very same so uh, finally i request you to kindly watch the video and nothing more than that so thank you so much